Hi guys, this is Paige. I wanted to make this video about this new Bible that I got. Um, when I found this Bible, I was so like excited about it. Um, this is a journaling Bible. Um, and I don't have another Bible like this. And um, so I looked up journaling, you know, online, you know, Bible journaling. And it's, it's like a very creative way of um, studying the Bible and using art um, with the Bible. Like I've even seen someone like painted in the Bible before. Like um, it's kind of like a creative expression. Um, and uh, I just think it's really interesting and cool, you know. Um, and a creative thing to do, you know, and, and it makes it fun. I haven't done it yet, you know, because I just got this Bible today, but I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, and I just wanted to share these verses too. This is 1 Corinthians 10 31. Whether therefore ye eat or drink or whatsoever ye do, do all to the glory of God. So you can even be like coloring in this book. And like um, doing art to the glory of God. Like we all have different gifts and talents God has given us. Um, and we can do all those things to the glory of God, you know. I'm not at that level where every single thing I do is for his glory, you know. Um, but it's good to remember that verse for sure. Um because we are his vessels of mercy and of glory. That's what we want to be doing, glorifying God. Um, and this is Colossians 3.23. And whatsoever you do, do it heartily as to the Lord and not unto men. So if you're doing it unto the Lord, like you're bringing glory to him, you know. Um, and this really comes in handy also like as a woman. Um... Like if you're going to get married or something like that, or if you have to do chores, you know, and, and like um, the cho be like, you know, guiding the house and all that stuff. Like say you have to do dishes, do it to the Lord, do it as unto the Lord. And because like I even notice like if I'm doing something I don't want to do, but you're doing it unto the Lord, like it's just better, <laughs> you know, and you're doing it for the glory of God. Like even in these small, tiny little tasks, that may not seem like they're glorifying God. Like if you're doing it in your heart unto the Lord, it is glorifying him, you know, because you're doing it for him and he knows that. Um, yeah, so you can, any type of talent you have, you know, say you're really good at painting, say you're really good um, at sewing or, um, you know, making things with clay, cooking, baking, you know, anything like that, if you're doing it unto the Lord, you know, it can bring him glory, you know, and, and make him happy that you're doing it for him, you know. Um, yeah, so here's the Bible. My creative Bible. And this is the sides. It's very girly. <laughs> it's like me. And um, I'll show you the inside. See, so it's like coloring, you know. Oh, like. and this is King James Version. You can find these online. Um, they have like different covers. And you see these spaces? These are spaces where you can journal in, you can write prayers. You can write verses that speak to you. You can draw pictures. You can, um, you know, anything, any kind of creative expression you want to do in here, you can do because it's like a, it's like an art book Bible, you know. And as you're, like, they have lots of these verses in here on the side that you can color. And as you're coloring them, I would think you can really, you could meditate on the verse and like learn the verse. So this is like a, a more entertaining and exciting way um, to 
to learn the Bible, you know, and that's good, you know, that we make it fun. Even if you have children that are, like, of, like, a higher age, you know, and maybe they're not, like, really, you know, as, like, into reading the Bible, you can make it more fun by doing, like, art with it, um, you know, stuff like that. It's really cool. I'm excited about it. You guys can look up Bible journaling too, and they do have things you can you know buy like um, different kind of supplies and all different types of things like you could buy stickers and kind of like um, scrapbooking. I don't know if you're um, familiar with scrapbooking. It's like where you can take pictures and you can take little art like anything you want articles or whatever and and put like little pictures with it. Like I think like. There's probably a lot of women that like scrapbooking. And you can make like a scrapbook um, Bible, you know, which is really cool, you know. Yeah, so I just thought I would share that with you guys. I think it's a really fun way probably to like learn the word and um, make it more interesting because we know the devil tries to keep us away from the word. And we can do this to God's glory. And that is a very good verse. The, the, the verse is actually in here and it's um it's written. Hold on, I wanna share it. <laughs> to remember this. Of course I'm not like at that level, but it's good to remember this. <laughs> that we can do that, you know. So even if you have hobbies, I mean, if they're, you know, clean hobbies, you can do those things as unto the Lord, you know. Um, of course, like, it's not good to, like, idolize things, but the Holy Spirit will show you, you know, if you're out of line or whatever with it. But, yeah. All right, I love you guys. I hope you like it and that, um, you know, you research about it or maybe even get one of these. To make um, your time reading the Bible like more fun, you know, <laughs> and uh, entertaining, you know. All right, I love you guys. Be blessed.